After weeks spent battling the monster, we have finally managed to destroy Dracula. But at a terrible price. Quincy lies dying at our feet. All we can do is be with him as he slips into oblivion. Mina is saved, yes. But for how long? The vampire's blood runs in her veins. Though the marks on her neck have disappeared, who knows whether they will reappear or not one day. True, we all saw Dracula disappear. Yet not one of us can say for certain whether we have actually defeated the fiend. Jonathan, please excuse my writing, but my hand trembles so I can barely hold my pen. After you left this morning, a strange dizziness came over me. I went out for some fresh air, and when I looked up, I was at Carfax. Dracula's home was summoning me as if he'd returned and wanted me again. As I write, I can no longer master the power that is drawing me there. I'm leaving on the first boat to Transylvania. I feel that I must go back to the castle. I am powerless. I must find out what is happening to me. Don't attempt to follow me. Your presence would only complicate things. Forgive me. Mina. Seward, my friend. My deepest fears were founded. This morning, Mina was overcome by a fit of insanity, and she took off for Transylvania, alone. Apparently, Dracula is back. Could you start investigating this matter in London and find out whether the threat is real? If so, you will have to recruit new allies and go back into battle. Beware, and be careful. I am leaving all post-haste to catch up with Mina. She only has a few hours lead. I hope I find her before it's too late. Jonathan. Welcome, stranger. Welcome to my humble inn. I hope those two brutes didn't hurt you. I cannot imagine what got into them. Never mind. You must have had a long trip, and it is already very late. Now, sit by the stove and get warm. If you need anything at all, I'm there in the kitchen. Please feel free, make yourself at home. I want to go to the castle. What is the shortest path? To the old castle. But it has been deserted ever since the Count disappeared. What do you want to do there, stranger? I don't have time to explain, but it is very important for me to get to the castle immediately. You ought to wait for daylight. The path is strewn with traps. You'll have to face countless unimaginable dangers. You'd better stay with me. We'll have a drink together. I cannot. It's a question of life and death. Whatever you like, young man. Well, you can take the old bridge behind the inn, but it's not safe. Is that really the only way? Oh, in any case, it's certainly the fastest.
Madam, I must go to the castle as soon as possible. To the castle? Oh, it's late. The road is long and hardly safe. You must be exhausted. Don't bother about going to the castle tonight. I'll get your room ready and tomorrow we're discussing. Tomorrow will be too late. I must go to the castle now. Do you really have to go? Tonight is St. George's Eve. At the stroke of midnight, all the evil roaming the world will be master on Earth. Do you realize where you're going and what you will face? Stay here. Don't go. For your mother's sake.
away! And don't come back! And don't come back!
My god! You shouldn't have touched that object. Misfortune is again our lot. Beware, you don't know what powers you are dealing with. It's Dracul! Dracul the Devil. Dracul? Is this in any way related to the Count? Dracula means the son of the dragon. In our country, Transylvania, the dragon is a very evil creature. It wreaks chaos and total destruction. The dragon is the guardian of the gates to hell. I found this slingshot at the foot of the cross. A slingshot is very practical. You can always count on it when you're hunting or poaching. Me, I hunt birds near the lake. You can see them up in the big old oak tree. There are always plenty of birds there. There was also a bird on the cross. It had been crucified. Ah, the fiends! I'm sure it was Viorel and his men. They're Dracula's infernal minions. They're bloodthirsty brutes. Me, I hunt for my food. With them, they kill for their sacrifices. But what devil do they serve? They disappeared for a while, but recently they have come back. When I pulled the stones away in the cemetery, I found a strange ring. A mysterious blue light was pointing right to the spot. Did you see blue flames? Blue flames only appear on nights when the demons have broken their chains. Tonight, no man in this region will dare brave the outdoors, even if the flames pointed to a spot with a buried treasure. Buried treasure? When I was a child, my grandmother would tell me the story of the invasions that beset our country for centuries. Practically every square inch of this land has been steeped in men's blood, but the invaders never found much. The peasants preferred to bury their most precious possessions rather than see them fall into the hands of the barbarians. It is said that their gold is cursed. Get that ring away from me!
I see. It's the flute belonging to the ruffians who were sitting there earlier. Do you know what they use this instrument for? You still have a lot to learn about the servants of evil. They use it to call each other. They communicate with one another by playing a melody. Then that's their rallying cry. Do you know what melody they play? I watch them. They weren't paying attention to me. They thought I was drunk, but it takes more than a dozen drinks to befuddle my brain. I remember the tune they used to call one another. Here it is. Did you know that this instrument belonged to the men who shoved you as they left? Be careful. They mustn't find you with the flute. Or you'll be in very serious trouble. I wonder what they use this instrument for. One day when I was in the attic, I saw them near the bridge. One man played a melody and another man showed up directly. I don't know whether they saw me, but they left right after that. and knock Diorga out. Fiorel is going to be furious. I have to hurry downstairs and lock the doors. May the good Lord protect us.
The bridge has just collapsed. Is there another way up to the castle? The bridge is down. I'm sorry. That's the only path that goes to the castle. Except perhaps... Uh... Do you know of another way? The old people say that there's an underground passage leading to the castle. But that's just a tall tale. If there's a passage, no one knows where the entrance is. I don't see how I can reach the castle. My time is short. Please help me. There are a lot of old legends in this region. The castle is said to be built with stones pried from the mountains by thousands of men who died for their labors. The old people say that the mountain is riddled with tunnels haunted by the souls of the damned. Whoever dares to brave the mountain is a fool. I have no choice. My wife's life depends on it. I must go. May God protect you on your mission. Perhaps the cabin conceals a route to that hell. You should go out there and look. But all the roads to the cabin are blocked. I must find a solution. I cannot help you, and I'm not familiar with the house. I'm not the best person to help you. The bridge has collapsed. It was very hard for me to get back to the inn. You must help me find another path to the castle. Viorel is furious. I had to lock the doors of the inn to escape his anger. I think he's convinced that we're helping you. I'm so afraid. What is to become of us? I need you more than ever now. How can I possibly get out of the inn and reach the castle? If there's no other way, I will have to confront Viorel. Too much is at stake. No. I cannot let him harm you. Those people have made a pact with the devil. There is no way you can win. There may be a way out. A few days before he died, my late husband told me about a passage through the cellar. Hurry. Time is short. Show me. Alas, I never knew what he was talking about. But he seemed so frightened, so ill. You may find some clues in his notebook. I put it away in the cupboard. But I beg of you, be careful. Whatever is down there, that is what killed my husband. After weeks of searching, I have finally understood the purpose of the Dragon Ring. The ring is a key, a key to hell, to the world of the dragon, and the door to that world is just below us. I must hurry. I must protect my family. I have blocked off the passage and hidden the cursed ring in the spot where St. George protects the living and the dead. In the name of all the saints, may that door remain forever locked. Our lives depend on it.